the world of Hugh Hefner, that pajama-clad vessel of Viagra who made perusing the curvaceous bounty of the tender gender a noble pastime. How many dads have stumbled through the front doors of their suburban castles, pickled in gin and settling in for a night of mind enrichment, courtesy of Playboy's greatest alibi, the articles. Playboy the Mansion doesn't really have much to read. There is some small detail about building your empire, but who cares? Check out the construction crew. You can almost hear the shivering glasses that contain perfectly assembled martinis. Okay, maybe not. Before you can create the brand, you gotta make the man. Hef wasn't hip in a day, you know. It takes work, pressure, and yes, some pain to be El Hefe. Because the game is concerned with self-absorbed narcissists, it has happily done away with any detailed elements of The Sims. Beautiful people don't crap. Beautiful people don't clean, or cook, or eat, or die. They drink, dance, and spend other people's money. They mate and never get pregnant. They're super people, and you, as Hef, are their king. Bling dong! Who's there? Yay! It's Boobzooka and Little Teabag! Let's party! Similar? <laughs> the pixelated sin lovers that flow through the mouth of your mansion are the fuel raws of Hef's success. Each of them have a little something they can contribute to Hefner as he ascends the throne to party Caesar. They'll be given the assignment of putting together the magazine. You'll need to hire writers and photographers. <laughs> Apparently, the only people you can hire are hippies. Hire a playmate, and you're off to the photo shoot. Catch the loquacious, buttery landscape of womanhood. <laughs> the titillating towers of Mount Mamory lay before your conquering gaze. As issues roll out the door, you'll be expected to hire better journalists and to con bottomed out celebrities out of their clothing. You'll strike international business deals, luminaries like Felix the House Cat. It's all about the Benjamins game, fan. The man cannot live spending bread alone. Reap the benefits of power. Bumping donuts is really simple in this game. Flirt, rub, tickle, gift, and you're in. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. At the end of the day, the game moves at a relatively slow pace. Mind-numbingly long relationship upkeep will begin flipping the tiddlywinks so tedium your way as you endlessly navigate chat screens to arrive at all to similar outcomes. The game also doesn't look all that hot. If your fraternity pledge, a little buzz and phase from hazing, your jockeys may get a tad tight. But then again, you're desperate. With a winsome giggle, <laughs> we give it a three out of five. Well, the good news is that it's better than the guy game.